welcome to Skyrim. <laughs> Today we are going to build a Breton Necromancer. So let's go ahead and uh, get started. Let's start from the uh, prisoner save that it makes right before you make your character. Ulfric Stormcloak, Jarl of Windhelm. It has been an honor, Jarl Ulfric. Raylof of Riverwood. Lokir of Rorikstad. No, I'm not a rebel! You can't do this! Halt! You're not gonna kill me! Archers! Anyone else feel like running? Wait. You there. Step forward. Who are you? All right. So yeah, as I said, we're we're gonna go with a Breton. Let's see, Breton, and then uh, good body. We're gonna go with a female. Uh, so there is a quest from uh, where is it? It's in Markar. It's uh, the Temple of uh, Debel Debelia, I think. Gives you a uh, ten percent bonus damage two characters of the opposite sex and there's more male NPCs than there are uh, female so right off the bat that's a no no brainer <laughs> statistic optimization and then you take on to the effect that uh take into account uh, that uh the Dwimmer robots are all male so it's quite a uh, benefit so let's Pick a preset. I like that one. And then, yeah, that looks good. Let's see. Complexion, dirt. Let's get rid of all the dirt. Let's get rid of the war paint. I don't like how uh, their faces are, like, completely flat. And then, uh, let's see. Let's go face. So I'm going to... Customize this character a little bit more, and then we'll be good to go. I'll be right back. All right, we are back, and this is what I came up with. <laughs> it is uh, just some dark eyes. So the goal is to be a uh, necromancer slash vampire lord, and we're gonna use this character to complete the uh, civil war as imperials, dawn guard as vampires, and then the dragonborn quest line for all those achievements. Uh, so this looks good, and Breton 100% is only for the 25 magical resist. I was thinking Dark Elf at first. Uh, let's see if I can go to Dark Elf. Dark Elf have a 25% or 25 or 50% fire resist, which kind of counteracts the the vampire's negative fire resist. But uh, at the same time, uh, with a Breton, I can completely negate all magic with little effort. So. That is the goal of this, this choice. So we're also going to, our primary skill is going to be destruction. But we're going to have uh, necromancy from conjuration to do uh, like summon corpses and raise zombies. I've never used those spells, so we're going to try that out. Along with alteration, illusion, and restoration as the primary skills. So all magic is pretty much primary. We're going to do sneak as a secondary skill. Uh, we're gonna try no armor for a while, but uh, when we get light armor, uh, vampire armor, which is light armor, we're gonna pick that up and start wearing that. Uh, One-handed dagger will be our, we have no ma mana, and that's the only way we can fight, that <laughs> kind of thing. And archery will be usable, but only from bound bow. And, uh, so if it if it, we won't carry a bow, but if we need a bow for something, we'll 
use a bound bow. But I'm not hard, I'm not holding myself hard to any of this stuff. We're also gonna do alchemy, smithing, enchanting, and speech. So it's gonna be uh, a fun time. So let's go ahead and create this character. Get this process going. I'm gonna name her Emma after my EverQuest bard. And there we go. Are you from Daggerfall, Brett? <laughs> Fleeing from some court intrigue? Captain, what should we do? She's not on the list. Forget the list. She goes to the block. By your orders, Captain. I'm sorry. We'll make sure you remain so return to High Rock. Follow the captain, prisoner. Alright, so, uh... We're gonna get through this. We're gonna follow the storm cloak guy Alfred at first, but uh, only because the imperial hero, armor that the, the captain's wearing like the is uh, king and what we're gonna put on our our follower. Which we're gonna have a uh, quote unquote Plunge thrall, <laughs> like uh, vampires the have their thrall that down, follows them around and, and does their the does all their busy work and stuff. So. We're going to start with Feindel, and then eventually switch to uh, somebody else later on. But uh, we're going to put him in this ca guard captain's uh, heavy armor with a sword shield. And then, yeah. So let me see what else. We're going to try to hit level 3 by the time we get out of uh, Helgen Keep. And if we're not level three by the bear, we're gonna torch uh, the Stormcloak guy until uh, <laughs> until we get to level three. And that's about it. I'm gonna be off to the races here in a minute. I have a I don't know how many how many lines it is now, but I've kind of written not a script but a uh, a guideline for me, so I kind of know what I want to do for. Probably the first 30 levels, just to uh, make sure I'm not twiddling my thumbs. <laughs> uh, I've kind of cross-referenced all the quests and stuff, so if I'm in a certain area at a certain time, I'll know what I need to do and uh, how many uh, plants I need to collect for certain things in certain areas and stuff like that. And if anybody's interested in uh, a copy of that, I can. I can post it on this uh, first video. Just uh, ask in the comments. on that wing flap he does. Took us in, so we're gonna go right here. This is the uh, Stormcloak entrance, the other one's the uh, Imperial entrance. Alright. Once he gets in here, get him to cut us free. We'll meet again in Sovngarde, brother. Looks like we're the only ones who made it. Yep. Looks like that it. thing was a dragon. No doubt. Just like the children's stories and the legends. The harbingers of the end times. We better get moving. Come here. Let me see if I can get those bindings off. How do you get a war axe already? <laughs> there you go. All right. May as well take on your gear. He won't be needed. Sounds good. We'll take all that. Oh, that. Get that armor on. All right, let's uh, that. that magic, all oh, magic. So we're gonna favor all of these spells. Okay. Uh, 
not dragon skin. We don't care about that right now. So, if you swing. so let's put flames on one, healing on two. Let's put conjure on four. I'm going to see if I can find some way out. All right. Ah, this was locked. Let's see about that gate. Items. What did we loot earlier? Yeah, that's light armor, so we're not gonna put that on. No way to open this from our side. We're gonna hide and let him tank them and we'll burn them after that. Come on, soldiers! Keep moving! Cover. Let's hide. We might get a sneak level up here. it is on legendary mode. Alright, perfect. We are doing a legendary Stacks the uh, a dot of fire on them, so it's See if you can unlock that door. Okay, which that's the one he wants us to go through. We're gonna go this way because this is where the Imperials start, and I think there's a little bit more loot in here. Yeah, uh, take all that coins on the table, mixed unit tactics book. Empty chest, Imperial helmet, uh, iron sword, not oh, worth taking. Alright. Let's get in here. We looted all of them. Let's see what we got. Uh, we got a iron dagger, so our favorite one of those. Here we have no magic armor yet. We won't get that until this next room. Come on, let's get the here. Oh, four tomatoes, that's good. We are gonna make vegetable soup and all that stuff, because I love to cook the cook and all this stuff in this game. Cause it is very convenient, even if you're not doing uh anything with it. I mean it just uh helps you regenerate stuff faster and that's always convenient. Not with the bow. I need to hit him like with his sword. I'll have your head. I think he shot him with the arrow. later. Uh, let's see what's on the table. Take that. Just take, taking most stuff, just we're gonna sell it all, honestly. Uh, I have every <laughs> everything planned out. 
fairly far ahead, so... I just need a lot of materials for getting it all to fall into place. Alright, nothing there. Guess we're on to the next Done. part. Let's get moving. Alright, this is the, uh, torture chamber room, I think. Blood. Now it's a torture room. Hear that? Come on. Okay. So we're gonna kill the storm clothes. potions. So we can get these uh, magic regeneration armor. Grab anything useful and let's go. All right, let's go ahead and read sparks. Does more damage. We'll take the novice hood and that. Now where is? Okay, guess we're not gonna kill them right now. Take that. There's a book here. We'll take it. that and some more lockpicks got that got that got that what else is there all right let's get this these other uh doors Somewhere down here. Usually have like ten more and more. I did lose one. Two. Alright. Some gold. Alright, let's quick save right here. With the skeleton. This skeleton. All right, they're gonna let them go fight, and we're gonna Orders try to kill the storm cloaks. <laughs> That's the goal. To be killed by a dragon. We need to pull back. Just give the general some time. We should be a little better off now that we have this uh, this armor on. Killed all the storm cloaks. We're gonna let him. Uh He's he can't die. So. Let him go aggro them. Light them on fire over here. I'm very shocked at how slow this is actually leveling up. 
This one. Alright, he's dead. Put them all afterwards. And the reason I killed the storm folks is because they don't go past the store anyway, so there's no point. There's no negative Let's to killing them. Alright, so let's see. The way is clear. Okay. Ah, alright. Let's get rid of these swords. And it's iron weapons. And let's go over here. Where is the body? drop what we don't need so we don't want the battle axe that is not worth carrying around uh, let's see here we don't want the imperial swords either that's still 30 pounds uh, fur boots are not worth carrying they're for gauntlets or that so 35 for a hundred gold we need one of those actually. Let's see what else we can drop. Torturer's hood. What does that look like? Uh, put our weapons away. Oh, that looks pretty sweet. Too bad it's not black. Alright. Uh, Nervous hood. Let's get rid of the ragged robes. What's that look like? Trash. All right, let's put that back on. Let's drop that. That. Eight twenty-five. Let's drop those. All right, that gives us. I get some carry weight. And that's everybody. I believe. It's that guy. That guy. Okay. Let's keep going. Let's see where this goes. And then we go past here, the bridge falls down. Let's jump down here. It's like, I don't know, to me it feels quicker just to go this way. To get it real quick, because you can also go that way. Alright, we got that. Let's see here. Now we're coming up to the spiders in the next room. Get that. Alright. This is... I just want him to go in. We're not really making much progress level-wise. We're still level 1. And that could just be destruction level slow, so... Yeah, it's like hardly gone up at all. So, uh, what else can we level? Nothing else, really. We'd have to take damage for restoration. Uh, it's like a level sneak. Might have to do that, actually. So I'm gonna leave here at level 3. Go Come on, what are you doing? Guess we better try this way. So if we just probably, ha we're probably gonna just have, like, get the bear, just sneak attack him from behind with a dagger, like, a few times. Spiders are coming. Rat. I'm on your side. Are you? Because I'm not on your side. All right, more spiders jump down. Alright. 
they're dead. Alright, let's grab seven spider eggs in this room. And let's see here. Got these two. Empty corpse. The other two are over here. Let's get our flame back out. And that should be ingredients seven. Perfect. Hopefully we turn that into a potion later. If I remember to. Alright, this is where we, we get a little cheesy. <laughs> Uh, or not, I don't know. Ah, uh, we're carrying too much now. Let's drop... Let's see, that's like a good ratio right there. Let's drop one of these. These don't seem like that great of a ratio. We just need to keep one for, uh, follower. Hold up! There's a bear just ahead. Right. See her? Rather not tangle with her right now. Let's grab the mead and all Watch that junk. Uh, we don't need that. Or if you're feeling lucky, all right. So let's uh, might take a Is this even leveling it up at all at a decent rate? All right, we're at the T. Then watch your back. So slow. All right, let's just uh, sneak attack him. Get level three real quick. Ha! What are you doing? Hey, be careful! What are you doing? What are you doing? All right, so wait. Watch it. I'm That's not leveling up. Sneak is at 16. What are you doing? Come on. There, he moved. What are you doing? Watch it. Burn him a little bit, get all our mana gone. Hopefully we get 17 destruction. What are you doing? What are you doing? It's just increasing one hand. Alright. We have to run over here. Oh, we got skeever tail. Alright. Let's go back. Maybe we can our sneak on now. Nah, he's not gonna. It worked better before. <laughs> Come on, dude. Get over here. Need to waste time anyway to get our mana back. I don't think we're getting much, so we're almost there. Yeah, it's not really going up fast at all. Sneak. Almost leveled up. What are you doing? What are you doing? I'm on your side. Watch it. What are you doing? What are you doing? No. Unsneak. Go right here. Sneak. Because he doesn't detect us, it's hard to tell. Hey, there we go. That should be all I care about. Alright, let's do Magicka. Ah, uh, we can get the rest out of here, it doesn't really matter. Alright, uh... He gave us a bow, didn't he? Weapons, longbow, yeah. Let's get healing out. Let's see if we can sneak up on this bear. And then run away.
really? <laughs> Destruction levels really, really slow. I didn't think it would. I, think I got one level up the entire time, so that's crazy. All right. So, uh, no, no survival mode. But you can literally sit in there, there and goes. get to like Looks level like 100 and sneak and uh, some other no skills just by hitting else made it out alive. But I always use them as a uh, get enough. myself to at least level 2 if I can't make it. Alright. Alright. River Mill. Alright, sure got it. Help you out. It's probably best that we split up. Okay, so <laughs> I have every single creation club thing installed, and it's just, this goes on for like five minutes of these quests saying, uh, read this, read that, and then all this junk stuff I gotta throw out. So I am gonna go ahead and end this episode here. Next episode, we are going to uh, start our journey to Riverwood and uh, collect some stuff along the way, kind of like how I did in my uh, warrior video and my assassin video, so kind of the same stuff at the first but around video four we go get bit by the necromancer and start doing some different stuff but uh yeah so thank you for watching and have a great day